my name is Stacy Lund, and um, before I get started on the whole story of how this started, I just want to thank a couple people. Uh, first of all, Jennifer and Mark Winter um, of Mason, they're the ones that created this originally out in Mason. It's called Angels, Angel Alley, and I just thought it was just a beautiful tribute to children. Dale Eads for donating this beautiful space. Um, he's just a very generous neighbor. Uh, Casey Childs from All American Soft Wash for power washing the wall. Uh, Lee Mansky from All Terrain Landscaping for coming out literally in a day's notice to grade the area after our uh, lift got stuck in the mud. The City of Loveland for supporting and approving this project. Um, Jack McCann, who graduated with Ben Morrison uh, from Neighborhood Lawn Keepers for dropping the rocks and he'll be seeding the area as well. Um, the artists David and Brian from Jonathan Creative for creating this beautiful mural, especially for Loveland. Um, a big thank you to all of you, the Loveland community, for believing in this project and supporting it. I'm blown away at the support. Um, we have raised a little over half of the funds needed. Um, we still have a little ways to go, a little over $7,000, but um, we'll get there. Um, so how did the project start? I saw Angels Alley on Facebook, and I just thought it was a beautiful tribute. Um, I thought we needed to do love wins. Tori and Donnie are really good friends of mine, and they lost their son in 2021. Along with Sarah and Mike Wolf, they also lost their child in 2021 as well. Um, one thing that Tori always mentions to me, I didn't think I would cry, sorry. <laughs> one thing that Tori always says to me is that she doesn't want people to forget Ben's name. So I thought this was the most beautiful way to honor that. Um, I was walking around Loveland, I found probably 10 to 15 spots, and I contacted a few people, they didn't pan out. Um, my friend Megan and I were walking along the bike trail like we always do, and she stopped and looked and she said, what about this space? And I thought, oh my gosh, this is perfect, Dale's my neighbor, and it's kind of tucked away, it's just in a great location. So I called Dale and said, hey Dale, can I use your wall for this beautiful project? And he said enthusiastically, heck yes. So here we are. So to all the families, I hope this, you find peace and comfort in seeing your child's name on the mural. They'll never be forgotten. And to the community, I hope this just lets you appreciate where we live and slow down and appreciate um, all that we have here. We have rock painting that I would love everybody to paint a rock. And uh, the rock painting station is um, contributed by the Ben Morrison, the 988 fund. And the Girl Scout Troop 4025 is helping facilitate that. Obviously, all of us are sorry that we even need to have such a wall, but we are so thankful that you found a place in Loveland to call home for this wall. It is a loving, perfect tribute to your children. It's estimated over 150,000 people a year travel along this part of our bike trail, all of whom will see this wonderful tribute. So just know that all of you, your children, all the family members, all their loved ones are always in our hearts. We think of you often. We pray for you, and we're just happy to be able to, to have this as, as a place to come and, and honor them whenever we, whenever we need to. So thank you all for sharing your children with us. We appreciate it. Oh. Loveland is filled with love. This project is filled with love. The wonderful children that have been taken too soon from your loving arms will never be forgotten on this wall. I would just say thank you to Stacy. This truly means a lot to both Sarah and I, um, and this community means a lot to both of us as well. Yeah. Anytime our children's names are said, spoken, remembered, um, in a beautiful way like this especially, it means so much to us. And Loveland again and again steps up and remembers our kids. So, thank you, Stacy. <laughs> Got it. <too. laughs> Woo, those are nice scissors. <laughs> Yeah, I'll be here too. I'm gonna do it.